here. Uh, it actually seems like God himself, even though he doesn't exist, but still, God himself has said, let me put the sunlight on criminal juice. He needs vitamin D, and he needs my vitamin D and his vitamin B. Get it? Vitamin D and my dick and butt. Anyways, thank you, God, for fucking me in my ass. Thank you. I appreciate it so much. And guess what? One day I want to do a threesome with you and Jesus, honey. Bye. Anyways, um, uh, that has nothing to do with my video. You're like, so you're making a video about God and Jesus having a threesome with you. Not at all, actually. Um, here's the funniest part about it. I actually forgot what the fuck this video is about. And I'm going to think about it right now. Actually, I'm going to look at my notes real quick. What the fuck is this video about? What the hell? I forgot. Oh, no, I got it. Intermittent fasting. Yeah, baby. <laughs> you're like, what? You have notes. You're not professional criminal. You're disgusting. You're dirty. You pee in bottles. Well, I pee in bottles. I don't know how that's dirty. If I was dirty, I would have peed all over my floor. But that has nothing to do with intermittent fasting. So, intermittent fasting. I knew you were Indian. I knew you were Arabic. Yeah, well, I mean, a lot of Latinos, when they grow their beard, they look Arabic. And no, I am not a terrorist. Stop calling me a terrorist. I hate when you... Well, I'm not going to say I hate it because if I say I hate it, you're always going to call me one. So I'm not going to say I love it either. Okay, let's move on. Anyway, so intermittent fasting. Okay, let me tell you, explain something to you, why it changed my life and why it will change your life and why you will lose a lot of weight if that is something that you would like to do. Now, a lot of people do fasting and it's pretty cool. I don't do that crazy fasting where it's like, even though I've done it once in my life when I lasted a whole entire day and I didn't eat and I did amazingly well because the intermittent fasting made me so strong that I can easily do a whole day without fasting. But let me explain this to you and tell you the and how I learned how to do intermittent fasting. This should be pretty funny to you. So, I learned about it through, you guessed it, who are the two twins with BBCs that take steroids on YouTube? I'll give you a chance. You got it, the Hodge twins. Um, <laughs> uh, one day, I used to watch their videos all the time, and I still watch it to this day. Those guys are hilarious, but they don't make that much videos now because YouTube doesn't pay them. Fuck you, YouTube, and fuck you for not giving me money either because I'm saying curse words. But anyways, um, it doesn't matter. I'm not a partner of YouTube anyway, so who gives a shit? Uh, but um, yeah, basically, they started talking about intermittent fasting, and I was very, very into it. And they explained the whole thing. And when I hear something that could possibly make me a better person, make me healthier, make me happier, whatever it is, and it had to do with losing fat, and that's what I really wanted to do too. I'm like, dude, I weigh 240 pounds. I don't like how I feel, whatever. And I was still working out, but that doesn't feel good to be 200. Like right now, I if I have to look at myself, I think I'm like 220 or something like that. And that feels really good. I am actually happy about that. And by the way, this shirt is amazing. This is Moira shirt. Uh, yeah. Anyways, uh, Overwatch, really good game. Uh, so basically, they talked about it. They're like, if you eat in a, in, the, in a window of time, in a window, and I know you guys are like, I ain't going to do intermittent fasting. That's fucking hard. It's not hard at all. Shut the fuck up and let me explain it. Once I explain it to you and you do it, you're going to be extremely happy. So basically, intermittent fasting, they were explaining that. If you have a window of time that you eat and you stop, you will lose weight immediately because it's really bad for you to eat like six six meals a day. What? what? Oh my God. That's how you know the medical system wants you to die. They want you to eat six meals a day so you can get fucking diabetes and all these problems in your body that probably will cause cancer with eating that much meat and all that stuff so then they can get medical assistance. It's almost like they do this on purpose so they can make you ill so they could keep the whole system, the, the medical system running, it's really sick in the head. Sorry for having such a gigantic brain. I don't even know how this hat holds this brain inside. I don't know how this head doesn't explode. My brains just splatter all over the wall how smart I am. But um, I, this is all, all a plan. But anyways, um, the point is that they were like, okay, so you, if you have an eight-hour eating vi window, let's say you start eating at 12, and... In that eating window, you get all your calories in that time from 12 to 8. Once 8 hits, cut it. Cut it off. Just doing that alone, you'll be 100 times healthier. 100 times healthier you will be and you will lose weight. You'll be like, what the fuck? I'm losing weight? Yes. Because you're not eating at every hour of the day. Even eating breakfast is dumb. Like, You can actually still fast and, and, and by the way, and drink coffee. 
you could totally fast and drink coffee just make sure you drink a little bit of coffee it's only like 50 calories that doesn't really break the fast that much but i don't like to do that i just drink water i think that's the best but you can do that by the way if you're wondering but um i started off doing the eight hour immediately by the way i've been doing intermittent fasting now since feels like i don't know uh four years or something but straight i never stopped doing it uh so basically i did the eight hour eating when i saw it was easy i just had it in my head like why can't i just pack in the calories within that eight hour span then i started getting better at it nowadays my eating window is two hours or four hours two to four hours and i'm fine sometimes i eat all my calories literally in one shot like within one hour span and i'm good until the next day so i literally fast for 23 hours or more sometimes and i'm totally fine this whole lie about that you have to eat breakfast every day in the morning is the bullshit lie dude we only eat breakfast in the morning most of the time because we're like we're supposed to eat it right and they're like yeah you're supposed to eat breakfast so many years i would wake up and be like i'm gonna eat breakfast i'm not even hungry but i'm gonna eat it because i'm supposed to let me eat this cereal let me eat these pancakes which is basically like eating cake in the morning by the way it's disgusting think about all the carbs and disgusting sugar you're eating in the morning that's so dumb especially for kids and you wonder why your kids are so tired and feel like shit all the time kids are supposed to have a lot of energy and your kid is like sleeping at the breakfast table it's like yo mikey wake up and you're like what oh sorry i'm in a fucking uh pancake coma i'm sorry mom but he you know giving me a disgusting pasteurized milk with disgusting pasteurized orange juice and disgusting pancakes and, a, and some pieces of bacon is not going to be good for your system but thank you anyway mom i know you're trying to look out for me you just don't know any better but yeah eating breakfast is dumb and if you even are gonna if you're that person that you insist i guess on eating breakfast at least do some fucking at least try to start the intermittent fasting when you start you know be like okay so i'm gonna eat breakfast still i'm gonna do eight hours only and stop there even if you do that, that's okay. And at least try to eat some 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 fruits or something a little healthier, maybe some oatmeal, because that shit's gonna put you to sleep, dude. It's gonna put you to fucking sleep. Intermittent fasting is amazing. The results are crazy. Uh, you don't even understand how fast. Like in one week, if I take the intermittent fast is serious, I I thin down so much. Like like the fat right here, like. Like, I've been, just lately, I've been eating too much and eating for too many hours at a time. So I've been slacking, right? And I gained a lot of weight on the sides. And then I was like, I'm going to start getting back to my intermittent fasting, doing my four-hour window. Like that. In, like, fucking nine days, that shit is all gone. Losing weight, you know, getting trimmed and stuff. Losing weight is the easiest thing in the planet. You think it's not easy. And the funny part is, I'm not even telling you, you got to cut out some of the nasty shit you eat, even though you shouldn't be eating nasty shit. You should get like some, maybe some chicken over rice, stuff like that. But even when I would eat garbage food and intermittent fasting, I wouldn't get nowhere near gain as much weight as I would when I would be eating all day, obviously, you know what I mean? So it helps even even if you're some fucking super unhealthy person, it, it, it's, it's just a hundred times better for you anyways. But I don't suggest that. I suggest you eat greens, you know, a lot of water, drink. If you're going to have a, a cheat day, have a cheat day. But you know what I mean? But intermittent fasting, try it out. Stop talking shit. All you people going, but they said if you drink, sorry. They said if you drink cabbage water, uh, you're going to lose weight. I'm like, I'm sure they did. What else did they tell you? To put a finger up your butt with like peanut butter and you'll lose weight? How about you just do intermittent fasting? And guess what? Look up all the benefits for intermittent intermittent fasting. People who usually fast live way longer, have way more energy. And that, and I would know because I would know how I feel. Specifically, I love working out fasted. Working out fasted? You're telling me that the weight is not just going to fall on my fucking face? Oh! Ooh. No. I actually feel 100 times stronger now. I'm fasted right now as we talk. Uh, when I lift that weight that you see behind me, like 250 pounds, it ain't shit. It actually feels so much better. When I used to eat first and then work out i used to be sleeping i used to be like and then i used to wake up like oh, oh, oh 
shit. Like I used to fall asleep because I'm in a fucking sugar coma. That shit is not good for you to fucking eat a whole bunch of garbage and then whatever. If you want to take a pre-workout or whatever you want to do or post-workout, whatever, whatever, I guess. But I suggest you try working out fast. It is a lot more beneficial for you too. You lose a lot more fat when you're working out and you're fasting. Oh, man. The fat just jumps off your fucking body. And like I said, the benefits of you living for a longer time, your skin being healthier, everything about your body will turn you. You'll get harder. You'll be able to jerk off like better. So many things intermittent fasting does for you. The benefits. Look it up. Don't take my word for it. But uh, look it up for yourself. I just wanted to give those tips out there because I know a lot of people struggle with that. A lot of gamers struggle with that. I'm a gamer as well also musician and all that and i know how it is and how hard it is to just keep up even if you have a really really busy time in your life and you're always working and stuff like that and you're like fuck i wish i could hit the gym at the very least you'll be intermittent fasting you'll be living for probably 20 years longer you'll be running a marathon at 105 years old probably and that's actually a real thing by the way there's like some indian guy that he fasted a whole bunch and he was running the he did the 25 mile or 27 mile marathon at 105 years old i'm like well you know what but you just do your research yourself because that's what i do i don't just jump into things and i'm like oh, i'm not gonna do it Ugh. i'm not even gonna research it either i'm just gonna say fuck you you're crazy and all that stuff no try it out it's really good for you uh i'm probably gonna eat probably way later on like probably five or six o'clock it's probably been mm, how many hours since i ate like 17 hours and i don't even care and guess what you're gonna say but what if i'm fasting and i'm out what if i ate all my meals and i'm with my girlfriend or boyfriend or friends and they're eating and then i get tempted guess what when you do intermittent fasting food is nothing anymore me at the side of food i used to be like like can i get some can i get some please i used to be like that and now i'm not like that anymore at all it doesn't even bother me at all you can eat the most delicious. You can eat my favorite meal in front of me, and I won't even phase me. I'm like, like that. I already ate. I already ate, baby. Let me think about. It. Do I want to eat that? Mm. Mm. No, I don't want to eat it. I want to spit it out because I already ate, bitch. Yeah, it's also good for that too. Your your hunger levels are not like, oh my god, I need food. No, 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 no. I love eating food. Food is the best thing in the world. But I use it for my energy and I, and I and when it's time to eat, I eat. You get know what I'm saying? When it's time to not eat, I don't eat. Try it out 100%. That all, uh, that's all it is. Yeah. Have you ever kissed someone that intermittent fast? It's amazing. Anyways, subscribe. Thank you very much. Uh, if you want this shirt, it's, uh, it's, it's at H&M. I think it's really cheap. It's, only, it's an Overwatch Moira shirt. Really cheap uh, if you want it. It's really cute. And I'm really cute. Thanks. I appreciate it. Subscribe to everything. Suck it. All in the description box below. You press the description box and then you'll see I have a Twitter. And you'll see that I have a dick. If you press down here, you keep touching the dick. And you're like, why the hell is that shit so small? It should be a normal size. I'm like, who are you to tell me it's a normal? I was born like that. Why are you making fun of my dick? It's, it's small. It is what it is. All right. Bye. Thanks.